Hi, Han. Hi. Thank you. Thank you for being with us, first of all. Thank you. <laughs> when I was playing in 1960, I played with Sonny Rollins, I played with Dexter Gordon, I played Ben Webster, to call names like famous for Mozzie. I played the first time in Italia in 1974 with Gato Barbieri in Milano. So I played a sort of traditional style, but at the same time, I played with Peter Brutzman and I did play with Misha, and my whole life I played with Misha. So I was always tempting on two, on two levels. So if you are, when you are a baterista, and that's what I am, I like to play time. And if it's getting too noisy, too abstract, and I don't hear form, I'm not interested because then you better, good example, put your bat battery in a common hailstorm with contact microphones and you have the best weather report you ever had. <laughs> I think if you are a, a, a drummer, you have to keep time, but you also have to swing. And swing is very, very, very difficult. You can play like a rattle, but swing is another thing. And swing is like, you think about Kenny Clark, you think about Philly Joe Jones, you think about Lewis Hayes, in combination with the bass. And I do play with Ernst for about 35 years, and we are actually built on that sort of system. So you find it's a very, very, very close thing. But that's rare. You have many fantastic drummers in the world, but not everybody is swinging. Every day I, I think, how will it be not to be there? So I'm very happy to play. But my biggest aim is that I play very loudly, and suddenly I, I play myself, I disappear. The only thing what you see behind the drum kit is a cloud. I think, where's Han Benning? He's gone. And that's my aim. Well, when you, when you play, you play in a teatro, and you hope there are many, many people. When you make a drawing, you have a, a, a white piece of paper and yourself, and that's a totally other, different confrontation than playing. But the, the most beautiful thing for music, I find, is that you, when you play it, it's what Eric Goffey said, it's gone in the air, of course. You can listen to that, but the action, the music, the action is gone. Not with the drawing. The, the drawing is the end of what your mind says. Yeah, yeah I, I agree with what is on the white paper. Finito now. And then Nietzsche says, destroy it right away. Because it's the process. Musica. Musica is more direct. And more people. But when you have like a, a painting or a drawing, okay. But you still have to sell it. I'm reading lots of poetry, and I like good writers. But my life, like like serving two masters, is already so busy. We live since a while in the woods in Holland, so I don't come from Amsterdam. I live. I come from Hoger Smilde. It's a totally different. It's a pico pico no fracho in in the, in the woods. And it's about two, two hours driving, other machina to, to Amsterdam, so it's far. But it's only sort of nature we still can find in Hollande. Hollande is like one big garden, you know. And it's all fixed and the roads and stuff like that. And it's totally different. In Italy you can find wild spots in the Apennine. I've been in places, man, so beautiful. <laughs> yeah, you guys live in a wonderful country. Actually it's not one country, there are many countries together. And since I've been playing so often here, I feel ashamed not playing, uh, not speaking Italian. And I have so many friends here. But every time you, now we are in Piemonte, but if you go to Lombardia or you go to Puglia, you say, now we're going to eat good. You know, there's still in the wine and in the food, and very proud of the products what they have. <laughs> And it's very, very musical country also. Don't forget. Thank you and all the best luck to you. And thanks. Thanks a lot. Thank you. <laughs> Fantastic. Ciao.